Asante Kotokos Danlad Ibrahim and Accra Hearts of Oaks Daniel Efriye Banier have been named in Ghana's squad for the 2022 FIFA World Cup in Qatar. Head coach Otoado announced the 26-man squad to represent Ghana at the World Cup for the fourth time. Late injuries to goalkeepers Richard Ofori, Joseph Wallacott and midfielder Baba Idrisu meant that they were left off the list. Mubarak Wakaso, Jeffrey Schlopp and Joseph Pencil shockingly missed out on the final squad despite making the provisional list while Antoine Semenyo, Ali Duseidu and Salis Abdul Samed were the surprise additions to the team. Here is Black Stars head coach Otoado announcing the squad. So I'm happy to be here among you to represent you, the 26 players who will be at the Copa Mundial 2022. So, the first name is Lawrence Atizigi from Zangalan. Second name is uh, Abdul Nuruddin from Cars Open. Then we have Ibrahim Dandat, as you see already. Um, I will continue with Dennis O'Doyle from Club Bruges. Then we have Tariq Lamte from Brighton Hall Avian. Then we have Alidu Seydou from Clermont Foot. We have uh, Daniel Amate from Leicester City. Next one is Joseph Edu, Celto Vigo. Alexander Jiku, RC Strasbourg. Mohamed Salisu, FC Southampton. Abdul Rahman Baba, FC Reading. Gideon Menza, AG Auxerre. Andre Ayu, Al Sat SC. Thomas Pate, FC Arsenal. Elisha Owusu, Ghent. Salis Abdul Samet, RC Laws. Mohamed Kudos, Ajax Amsterdam. Then we have uh, Daniel Kofi Cherry, SC Freiburg. Daniel Barney Afrie, Hearts of Oak. Kamal Sowa, Club Bruges. Isahaku Abdul Fatau, Sporting Lisbon. Osman Bukhari, Red Star Belgrade. Inyaki Williams, Atletico Bilbao. Then we have Antoine Semenyo, Bristol City. Jordan Ayu, Crystal Palace. And we have Kamal Dean Sulemana uh, from Stad Ren. After the announcement, Coach Otoado listed the criteria that influenced his selection and omission of players. Because, um, this is what, for me, very important to, to, to be the face of the national team, that I can work my way. So the decision at the end is mine, although surely we as a technical staff decide things together. And we have very, very um, yeah, strong values to build a team, which are very, very important for us. So there are criteria on the pitch, but also off the pitch. Surely we expect this. We expect uh, that you are, yeah, you are trustful because we know, and everybody knows in football, there's always a lot of happening, especially in the team. But the team for me is, it's not the family, but it's like a family. So everything which happens in the team should stay in the team sometimes. And then there are things on the pitch, like performance in the national team, performance in your club, um, the trainings, um, then also the, my KPIs, my uh, key performance, performance index. So my style of play, what do I want to see? And I'm very, very flexible. Um, so I, have, I want to have always in the squad uh, variables, which I want to use because every game is different. And even in the games, sometimes it brings different demands. Ghana Football Association President Keto Kriku, in his address, called on Ghanaians to be positive and support the Black Stars in Qatar. On the part of the FA, we are very positive. We have absolute confidence in our technical team led by Otowado. They've been working 26 hours a day to put a squad that is truly Ghanaian together. And I believe we have to give this technical team the respect, we have to give them the, the support, and we have to pray for them because it's not been an easy road. City Sports hit the streets to sample opinions on the squad. We have a very solid team and Ghana is going to perform. We are going to play well and probably we are coming home with the car. <laughs> uh, to me, uh, I think the squad is good. Apart from Snob, which I think uh, 
I had wanted him to be part of the squad, uh, looking at his current format, uh, Crystal Palace. So if you are taking his counterpart, which is uh, Jordan to uh, the World Cup, then I don't see the need leaving Slope out.